But in the 1940s, Claude Shannon, the father of information theory, started asking a different question. He went back to Markov's original idea of predicting text, but instead of just using vowels and consonants, he focused on individual letters. And he wondered, what if instead of looking at only the last letter as a predictor, I look at the last two? Well, with that, he got text that looked like this. Now, it doesn't make much sense, but there are some recognizable words, like way, off, and the. But Shannon was convinced he could do better. So next, instead of looking at letters, he wondered, what if I use entire words as predictors? That gave him sentences like this. The head and in frontal attack on an English writer that the character of this point is therefore another method for the letters that the time of whoever told the problem for an unexpected. Now, clearly this doesn't make any sense, but Shannon did notice that sequences of four words or so generally did make sense. 